All right, so I have the Boya mic right now. So this is the Boya, as you've seen from the intro there. So here's the Boya mic, and this is what the Boya mic sounds. I'm just gonna watch this a little ways out. I'm not gonna do a huge, huge, big, you know, distance or nothing like that. This is just gonna be the Boya, and then I'm gonna compare it to DJI. So really and truly to me, this right here is far enough. Uh, I'm not gonna do my, my distance or walk like I normally do in most of my videos. There's some people over where I normally go. Anyways, this, this is what it sounds like right now on the Boya mic. This one here is almost a direct comparison to the DJI mic with even built-in recording on it. So you can actually record things on, on the, it has, you know, the built-in uh, memory inside of it. But this is what it sounds like with uh, the Boya mic. So what I'm going to do now is, uh, just like the DJI mic, we have where you can hook up a lapel. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hook up the lapel and then we're going to see what it sounds like from the lapel. All right, so now this is the Boya mic. It is uh, connected through the lapel right here. Uh, I didn't take my windscreen or nothing off, but it is re uh, you know, recording through the lapel, which is coming through right here. So again, I'm just gonna walk around just a little bit. I had AC units over here at my apartments. They're going off. Uh, I live with the freeways right behind my apartments here. Um, it's very windy today. Uh, you're gonna start seeing these trees probably blowing. Uh, we got some storms coming in. But anyways, so this is what you're going to expect whenever you're on a lapel uh, microphone. So now I can put this wire underneath my shirt and just have it just right here. And it's just my lapel now. So I don't have to worry about any type of bulk or the, you know, dead cat windscreen or nothing like that. I don't have to worry about that uh, using the lapel, which I really do like that factor. Uh, this, this right here is a good factor and a good selling point uh, for me whenever I was looking at some of these. So now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hook up the DJI. All right, so now I'm on the DJI, as you can see right here, the DJI. Uh, and this is what it sounds like on the DJI. Uh, just like the Boya, they both have the magnetic backs. That way you don't have nothing dragging and hanging on your shirt. So I'm gonna do the same thing. Again, uh, just like in the Boya, and these AC units right here are working. I uh, do have some wind going on. There's a freeway that way behind our my apartments here. So again, I think this right here is more than sufficient for what most people are gonna be using this for. You only got a, a three to five percent people that are actually gonna be walking around. So I'm not so, you know, I don't wanna be focused on how far these mice can really go. That's just not what I wanna do because it's not gonna be realistic in, to me, in 95% of everybody's workload, if not even more than that. Especially doing this TikTok, face, Facebook Reels, Instagram, stuff like that. But this is what the um, microphone sounds like from the DJI out here, uh, which there again, we're gonna go through what some of the differences are. This is straight raw. This isn't no, um, whatever YouTube compresses down. I'm just gonna leave this normal. I'm not screaming. I'm just talking at a normal tone. So just like the boy, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hook up the, uh, the lapel microphone, this thing right here, and show you how it sounds. All right, so now, just like the Boya, I can hook up the lapel microphone right here. So I do have the lapel microphone hooked up, and it is right here, the same place that I had it on to uh, the Boya. Now, again, you can clip this anywhere. This wire can go up underneath your shirt. But, again, I do like this. I like it where everything's out of sight, out of mind. I can run that underneath. I can do whatever. Um, it, it's just nice. Uh, AC unit over here just clicked off. I do got some wind blowing in my face. So again, this is the first I'm gonna go because I'm not trying to do a distance test or nothing. This is just to show you what it's gonna sound like if you're like doing something. So like me, I'm ready. We have some car shows and some other stuff that's gonna be going on. I'm gonna take my drone up in the air and I'm gonna be doing little bitty clips here and there and uh, going from there. But um, we have the Longstar uh, truck, uh, Longstar uh, truck show, I think that's what it's called. But anyways, uh, coming uh, again here in a few months and I'm gonna be doing a lot of interviews. So I, me personally, I wanted to get this DJI mic. If you watched my um, comparison between the new Fifine M9 and the DJI, I really need another mic for a lot of things that I'm, I'm gonna be doing because I'm gonna be interviewing people and I don't wanna be taking off my mic to there. I wanna keep my lapel on and then interview people. But anyways, this is what it sounds like on the DJI coming through the lapel right here. If you don't mind at this point in time, go ahead and Smash that uh, that like button. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button if you're not subscribed yet. Hulk smash! Getting all that out of the way. Again, another non-sponsored video. You already heard the DJI and the Boya mic. So if you notice, the Boya did a little bit more, but when my back was turned, it cut out just a little bit.
you know, it, got, it gurgled. But the DJI did it as well, but it, it did it an extra 10 or 15 foot in front of me. So we're going to go through the, through the two. So the DJI mic, which is this one right here, it just comes in this soft pouch right here. And, of course, you get um, the mic right here, the mic itself. You get the receiver, so the transmitter, the receiver. And then you get an Apple adapter and a USB-C adapter. Uh, and then you get your uh, TSS or TRS, whatever, for your digital camera right here. Uh, you get a charging cable in it. But that's it in this one right here. And this, for the single one right now, I'll leave affiliate links down below. Any affiliate links will help me buy more products and get more uh, products for the channel. I don't make no money off of none of this crap. Mine is just to build up and get the community going. I really don't care about really making money out here. I just want to be heard, and I want y'all to, to listen and get that honest review that that we all need. But anyway, so this one right now on Amazon is one fifty nine. Uh, the Boya mic. Oh, oh, hold on. So this one is one fifty nine right now on Amazon. The two pack with two mics, two transmitters, and one receiver, uh, with the charging case, uh, and everything else that you get in here is uh, two fifty nine. And then the new DJI mic two is like three forty nine. Insane. The Boya now, it comes with this little cradle, and I did a full review on this. Go ahead and check it out. I'll try to remember to leave a link down, but go to my channel, check out um, the Boya. Anyways, you get two transmitters, one receiver. Same thing, you get a Apple adapter, and you get a USB-C adapter. Now, this is what the um, DJI will actually look like. This is literally how they have theirs. I'm going to pull this dead cat off. This is literally how they have their setup as well. So it is a really nice little setup. The case itself is a charging case. It is also a battery backup for the actual um, lapel, or it's going to be the microphones and the receiver. So I'm just kind of curious. I wonder if DJI can go in there. I doubt it. Yeah, no. Nope. It's, it's all different problems. Oh, man, that would have been nice. You know, throw that DJI in there. But. You get all this, and then you get a separate little baggie, like this right here by Boya. And that's where all your dead cats and your USB-C to USB-A adapter goes. Uh, it also comes with the lapel mic, which is this one right here. So you get a, you get a, a big bang for your buck here. I mean, it, that's a lot in here. Now, unlike the DJI, the one that I have here, which is, I think, the DJI One mic, or mic one, the Boya has a noise cancellation. The noise cancellation, I'm not going to do a test. That They're not bad. But, again, I like to do all that in, in my edit if I'm going to do any type of noise cancellation whatsoever. Everything in this video, the only thing, like I said when I was doing the DJI mic, the only thing that's going to be taken down at all is whatever YouTube does. This is all raw 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 sound besides my mic right now i do have a you know uh, sound suppression or noise cancellation should i say uh with sonar gg anyways so they both have the magnetics you can magnetic they both have the lapel hookup so they're both about the same size like literally about the same size on every avenue so it's really really nice that boya whether they copycatted DJI or not, that Boya brought this to the table because you get this whole thing. I got mine for, I think it was $139 or 149 and I believe that they are $99 nope. now to $100 and something. dollars. Uh, a lot of people don't know, but the magnet for these, you can actually put on the bottom over the plug where you can actually stand them up on your desk or whatever you're doing. They'll just stand there. Same thing with the DJI. You just take off your magnet and you stick it on the bottom and it will become a little table for your microphone so you can actually set them up. So all in all, I mean, for the sound, I, DJI might be a smidge cleaner, but is it worth that extra price? I, I, I scratched my head. I mean, I literally, I, I scratched my head on it. Uh, what the Boya offers is really, really nice. Uh, if y'all didn't check it out, uh, Fifine also has a new Lavenir set, the M9. I did a comparison between 
this and that one. I did a comparison between the Boya and that one. I mean, these are anywhere between $72 is what the Fifine is. So this one being around a hundred bucks to 150 for the DJI. But if the, the Fifine is also like this here, where it's two microphones, where the DJI, you're only getting one microphone because if you try to get into this, this realm right here, you're spending, I mean, double what Boya is. You're, you're spending 250 bucks. And that's even for the last two years ago generation model. Um, the, the mic one, I, and I don't know what more the mic two has to offer because I mean, I'm not big enough for anyone to send me nothing. So, but yeah, no, there, there's your difference. Uh, they both have the built-in recording. Um, that's another thing. I mean, that's a plus they both have built-in recording. So, I mean, these things are neck to neck and it's going to be your buying decision. 100%. Me personally, I think this sounds just as good. Yes, I'm gonna, you know, you might have to play a little bit with some audio, but when you're trying to take background noise out, anyways, you're gonna be playing with the audio no matter. But no, that's my final, y'all. Um, go ahead, leave, leave links down below and tell me if uh, what microphone you think sounded better. Leave comments, man. I'm a little channel, leave them comments. But like I said, I did a boy, the um, M9 versus the DJI. I'll go ahead and leave it on one of these corners right here. I don't know, I can't remember which one it is. All right, I'm Thomas of Tomology. I'll catch y'all in the next one.